Alright guys, what's up? We are back. I got back from Toys R Us and got a bunch of new traps. So let's get right to it. So we've got a Wave 1 regular uh, water trap. It's like a cannon. Yeah, it's like a gun looking cannon. I have the magic version of it that Activision so graciously sent me. So now we have a water addition to the team. Oh, that came out really nice. Oh, and it's broke. So there we go. It's a weird look I'm on. It's definitely not my favorite trap design by any means. But we have a Wave 2 trap that I was lucky enough to find. And that's like a angel looking bird uh, water trap. Check that out, man. That's nice. It looks like an angel. You would literally see... Um... Oh, I'm bleeding. Huh. That's different. Okay. Um, yeah, it was literally like an angel you would see on your uh, Christmas tree. I don't know how I'm bleeding. Probably cut myself from the cardboard because I was so excited when I had the Toys R Us, but whatever. It's all good. If you guys could send me a bandit, that'd be great. I don't die. There we go. There's that awesome looking angel one. That really looks nice. I like that. Really nice, man. That represents Christians perfectly, too. Look at that. Mmm. Doing Christ well, man. Doing him well. And, uh, next we've got more fire traps. So, I was able to snag, um, a Wave 1 fire trap that I already had a green one of. This was also the E3 version, which is this one, which I did not open because I'm too skeptical of opening it. So, we have the red one, though, which is really cool. Because I only had one fire trap, which has captured Chef Pepper Jack. And he's an amazing villain. I recommend him to anyone that beats him. Chapter 5, I believe, so look out for him. He's definitely worth trapping. So there we go. Here is the fire, like, torch gauntlet looking thing. The, the uh, red actually really compliments it. It does look beautiful. That, that um, really clear... Red crystal, that looks great with this one. I like that. That stands out. That's beautiful. And then we've got a new Wave 2 fire trap. And this is like a tiki robot monkey looking thing. Not a tiki, but like a monkey or a robot. And I was able to snag him at Toys R Us, luckily, too. And let's unbox this sucker. So here we go. It looks like a monkey. I can't really make it out though. Let me know in the comments what you think of that one. I have no idea. But once again, that red is just captured so beautifully, man. It's like blood red. Not to be gross, but... So now I have three fires and four water. Next, we have more uh, tech traps. Only had one. So I found a Wave 2 tech trap. It's got the angel design once again. And I think that captures the angel even more than the uh, blue one. Oh, look at that. Mm. Look at that, man. That looks like something you'd put on your top of your Christmas tree. Am I right? That's awesome. God's not dead, baby. There's a sign right there. Uh. And we've got another Wave 2 trap that I snagged from Toys R Us. The hand of, like, the mummy. I also got that for the undead, I believe it was. Spend some time. There we go. There is the uh, zombie looking hand thing for the tech. You can really make out the design fondly as opposed to the undead one. It's much uh, more translucent. Very nice. So now I have three tech traps, so finally I can put my shred knot in it and my bruiser cruiser in because I love them all. They're all great. But once I get Dr. Crankin' Case, he'll probably be the one that goes in uh, trap first. 
And finally, I've got a series, uh, um, wave two life trap, and it's like a toucan, like bird, pelican thing. And I believe I only had, oh yeah, I, okay, so yeah, I got a free life trap with the game, and then Activision sent me one as well. So this will be my third one. Oh man, I like the green on this one. Look at that. Ooh. That looks yummy, man. I almost want to eat it. Look at that. Oh. That bird design just gets captured so nicely through that green. Look at that. It's light enough to really capture the essence of the toucan. That's nice, man. So now, let's put them all in, which is usually what I did in the videos that I put them in before. My apologies, but it is what it is. And the tech ones, Dr. Crank Case, you get that one. And fire, he's going to get. There we go. So I'll show you a close up. I apologize, I usually actually show the close ups one at a time, but whatever. That collection is looking mighty fine. Look at that, if I do say so myself. Uh huh, uh huh, huh. Look at that. Uh huh. Alright, so there we go. So thank you so much for watching everyone. Stay tuned for more videos in the future and God bless. Peace!